What's up, guys? We're back at it once again with more Into the Flames, and we're on the Canton County Free Roam today. We're changing it up just a little bit, and we're going to be doing some of your requests. We've had some people asking about rural fires, like, can we do uh, residential fires, rural residential fires, barn fires, that sort of thing. Uh, so that's what we're going to be focusing on today, and we're taking out the white trucks. We've had people asking about the white trucks as well, too. I love these. They look so good, especially that brush truck rust truck in the tanker so uh we've got a fire going we're going to cancel this one out and we're going to find one that i want to uh, respond to all right so we've got our fire going man what a beautiful sunset looks like a, a gorgeous wintry evening right i didn't realize that we had snow textures on canton county too but man it looks cold out here right uh the fire the fire is going and it's going to be uh, 25 Pine Road, fire in the bedroom, box 310. So we're going to go ahead and take that one. Uh, we'll hit exit. And it's literally just going to be around the corner, which I don't see any smoke. So it may not be a legit fire. We'll just have to kind of roll up there and see. We'll, uh, we'll respond in the brush truck and then, uh, we'll kind of go from there depending on what the situation is. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here. Man, that thing looks good though. I love the, uh, the white equipment. I don't use this scheme on the Canton County, or not on the Heights. The Heights, sorry, I was wanting to say Canton County for some reason. The Heights map, because uh, not all the equipment has textures for this uh, scheme, at least the last time that I looked and I got them. So uh, it would be kind of a hodgepodge on that map. And I'm looking at uh, trying to keep everything uniform. It's a little easier to do on this map. Wow, my. Will, my G29 was just freaking out on me for some reason. All right, so yeah, we do have a fire going. Uh, Let's hop out. And let's get, uh, we do have tool specific, or truck specific tools. So let's get forcible entry and let's go air pack. Do a quick 360. Oh, we do have some propane back here. Yeah, we've got a propane tank. Uh, it looks like one fire limited to this uh, front corner here. Let's see what else we got. Oh, yeah. No, it's not actually. It's uh, well involved. Yeah, the house is well involved. Check out the other side here. I wonder, can we vault through this window? No, we can't even get to that. Let's go in that window to do a search real fast, and we'll see about bringing a tanker. We'll do some tanker ops. Hopefully, he's topped off. The brush engine is, so that's good at least. Uh, let's go. Let's see. We need a 14-foot ladder. We got it. Uh, let's swap. There we go. We got our ladder now. We'll go in this uh, other side of the house here. We'll check it out. I don't think there's going to be trap people, but you never know. Yeah, we really just can't. Yeah, that's not going to work at all. Like, we need a uh, a good way to get to that. Like, it's just not... Well, at least we broke the window. You know what? Let's drop this guy down right... Oh, well, it just got rid of it. Never mind. Yeah, it's not giving us the option to uh, vault. Well, there we go. We could jump up and get in. We'll just do that. Well, actually, never mind. There we go. All right, we had to jump up to get in. That works out better than the ladder. The ladder just really wasn't going to work out for that. So this room is empty. Uh, we got some fires on this side. Yes, we do. Yeah, it is going good. Let's close this back. Let's see if we can at least save the bedroom, right? Come on, close. I need to close. Please close. All right, let's at least save one room, right? Oh, we're being burned. No, oh, no. What happened? It just flashed on us. Man, it just flashed on us, and we didn't have RIT. It was okay, right? Like, everything was good and until it wasn't. Like, literally, I turned my back, and it went up. And, of course, RIT wasn't here, so uh, we're out of luck on that. We're SOL. Um, yeah, let's just hit return, and uh, we'll have to get RIT. Like, we need to uh, do some more stuff. Oh, that went downhill so fast, right? Like, that really just went downhill. Um, let's get the tanker. We'll take him. I've had that happen before, actually. The same scenario. Like, I was getting ready to leave the uh, burning structure, like, go out the window, and it flashed and got you at the last minute like that. So, man, it's like when it goes, it goes. There's not much you can do about it. All right, let's, uh, 
squeak through this intersection here around all them and oops wrong siren all right hopefully we're topped off on this bad boy yes we are that's good the uh, previous uh guys have uh, topped everything off for us all right so basically and uh what is going on in the back here is that the propane tank going now or yeah it's going to well that's fixing to blow up i've learned my lesson on those as well too <laughs> like we're not uh we're not gonna mess with that one guys i really i don't know we can try but i have a feeling like it's going to uh it's gonna go up we put a ground monitor on it but i don't think i don't think it's going to do us any good i could be wrong let's see let's go uh hose connections uh large discharge three yeah, by the time we get all this set up, it's going to be done. Let's uh, connect to that and let's get everything going. So we'll try, but uh, I don't think we're going to. It's, it's because it's only one of us, right? Like only one of us. There's not much we can do as far as that. Let's open this up. Let's go uh, max throttle. So this is an instance where we would do tank to pump, right? We got 350 going out. Uh, that's going to be what? Large diameter five. I think it is. Uh, we're, no, discharge three, actually. Let's open him to 105. That should be good. We're spraying ourselves down. That's always great. Uh, ground monitor. Yes, let's go like this. Let's see. Oh, this freaks me out so bad, guys. It really just does. I don't know how this is going to work out. I really, I'm not sure. Uh, and we got to get a water supply going, too, so... Man, it's just too much stuff to do, right? Like, it's a lot of stuff to do. Uh, it just blew up, so never mind. It's really, uh, it's really pointless now. And we're done with water, really? We don't have any water left? Is that it? Alright, let's put the, our drafting tank. Uh, that's gonna be the inlet and the outlet over here. Why is our water not... Our monitor's not doing its thing anymore. Are we out? We are. Wow, really? That was only flowing a hundred and we're out? Are you are you serious? That that literally ran for like I mean that wasn't even as much as a handline. A handline is 130 and we're already out. Wow, okay. Yeah, I man, I'm really kind of surprised by that, honestly. I that has me puzzled. Okay, let's do uh discharge on this guy. That really puzzles me as far as why. That should have lasted at least a little longer than that. Maybe he doesn't have that much of a tank on him. It could be. That could be the issue. Maybe he just didn't have a whole lot. Uh, Pump panel. So we need to do uh, tank to pump on this guy. Open him up. Max throttle. And let's open this up some more. There we go. Uh, it's going to be discharge five, right? Let's open this guy up all the way. So we can dump all our water. I hope that's discharge five. It should be. It looks like it is pressurized. Yeah, okay. Line's charged. Water's going in, so we're good on that. Uh, now we need the intake. Yeah, it had to be because this just doesn't carry much water. I'm not sure how much this carries, but it can't be a lot, right? Like It's not much. Uh, discharge three. Let's just close him off and... Yeah, I feel like if we had if we had plenty of manpower, it would have been a different situation. We might could have uh, prevented the explosion, but it's like it's just one of us, and we have a ton of things to do here. You know, like there, there's so much to do as far as like setting up your water and uh, getting everything else set up on top of that. There we go. Uh, now we need to do tank fill. Open this guy up. All right, so we've got uh, 350 coming in. So we should at least be able to charge a hand line, and we're already empty on this guy right here. Yeah, we're already empty. Uh, I keep seeing, like, some kind of weird effect in the back here. Let's go check the power, because this does have a power connection. 
Looks like a, the gas stove is burning too. Yeah, let's get this power shut off. Oh, we gotta use the fire extinguisher. Never mind. Scratch that. My bad. All right, uh, get the fire extinguisher. Man, I like this snow texture though, right? This looks really good. Really, really good. Like it really pulls off the winter effect quite nicely. Uh, what do we need? Fire extinguisher. That's right. It just does like with the trees and, and everything and then the low sun and the shadows. It just looks like a cold winter day. Nice. All right. Get this guy put out. I got a little arcing and sparking here. Come on. Are you going to go out or what? There we go. Interact with the breaker box. Let's shut it off. I love this part. I love like having to do all these little tasks. Uh, before you can start your attack. Like I said, this is true life. You know, there's a lot more to it. There's so much more to it than just putting water on a fire. I say that over and over again. Uh, I still got the ladder, really. I didn't even realize I still had the ladder. Drop that guy right there and let's swap to the ladder and uh, we'll run it up to the roof. We might do some venting and stuff like that. Venting. Do a little better though. Come on, Spur. Uh, I don't know. I still think we can do better than that. Uh, that most definitely is not going to work. Uh, good enough. Yeah, that's good enough. All right. Um, I'm trying to think. Do we want to bring anything else? We might could bring another engine from uh, Station Two. Hey, do that. Let's hop over to station two. Let's see. We got engine one. Let's grab him. Let's hit I because we're going to change the uh, custom skin. Let's do load custom skin and it should. There we go. Yeah, it looks nice. Uh, well, one more thing though. We got to do the uh, number color. We got to alpha it out. There you go. That's gone. And let's hit F to open the door. L for the lights. H for the headlights. There we go. Now we're set. Whoa, Spur. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I wasn't paying attention. There we go. Now we're set. We're on our way. Man, we got a fire over here, too. This, the county's burning. It's like we go in the heights. The heights is burning. Oh, uh, we come over here. The county's burning. It never fails, right? What? What do we have? Which way do we need to go? Okay, back to the left. That's going to be our fire. That is going to be our fire. It, you know, it honestly is kind of nice being back on Canton County. I, we've been on the Heights a lot, and I love the Heights map. It's a different take. Uh, I think it's a little bit more detailed in some aspects. Uh, it's just a great map, but this one is too, right? Like, don't forget about Canton County. This is a good one too. And while the Heights is like uh, purely um, purely a uh, city firefighting, this is a mix. This is a good mix of stuff. All right, let's hop out. And at least we've got a little more water. Our tank is empty because did we dump it all out? I think we did. That's something that still confuses me like no tomorrow. We dump, we lost all our water somehow. Oh, this one filled up. Okay, so he topped off. Really, I just don't see that brush engine holding that. Like, that makes no sense to me, right? He shouldn't, he shouldn't hold all that. I'd give anything if this house could actually, like, burn to the ground because it would totally be burnt to the ground right now. <laughs> like, it's taken us so long to get this set up. Uh, let's get the big tanker. Get tanker three. Hopefully they top this bad boy off too. All right, let's see. Uh, custom skid. There we go. That looks pretty sweet too. Actually, let's take care of the number. I always forget that. All right. Lights, headlights. Uh, hit F, open the door. I think this is probably going to be our only fire for today. It's taking a little bit more than what I, uh, than what I thought it would. I was hoping to get two in, but you know what? One's okay. One's One good one's okay. I don't take this one out a lot. I really don't feel like we need the water. We need all the water we can get. It's only half full too. Spurs an optimist, so it's half full. 
not half empty. Either way, it's still half, which sucks. Uh, the last uh, crew to use it were slackers. They didn't fill it up, right? They totally didn't fill it up. You should fill it up. You should always uh, take care of your equipment. And they didn't. We're going to have to have a talk to them. All right, let's see. Let's go back to the left. And we'll be set. Good looking truck. I like that Mac. Mac attack. There's our fire. It's still going. It hasn't burned down yet. Oh, this thing would be such a pain. Because we got to figure out, like, how to position it. What can we do with it? And then on top of that, like, if they need to leave to get more water, what is the best way for them to get out? I guess just to back around. Yeah, I think so. So let's take this guy. This should be all the water we need. <coughs> Sorry, I got a frog in my throat today. We shouldn't need any more water. I wouldn't think so. All right, let's hop out. Uh, how do we want to do this? We could run from that one to the intake on this one and just kind of like daisy chain them together. Maybe might be an option. Let's do uh discharge to take this guy to the intake of this one. We could run it straight to the drafting pool too. I mean, like there's a few ways we could do this. Do that. Now we've got him hooked up. Well, if you guys wanted to see some tanker ops, today is the day, right? Like, this has turned into way more than what I thought it would be. There's really, there's no discharge, really. Uh, okay. I've hardly ever used that thing, especially since the pumping update. All right, let's try tank fill. Let's try this. Oh, uh, we got tank to pump going. Let's do tank fill. Only 250. And it says we've got more going out than we've got coming in. So let's do. Oh man, let's go to first person to look at it. We're a discharge five is where it's going out. So let's do that. Got to cut this guy back a little here. There we go. Oh, uh, do we have any water coming in? Like, what are we doing here? All right, so we got tank fill going on this bad boy. Uh, it shows that we have 250 coming in. Oh, the, the county is descending into chaos while we try to figure this out. And we have no water left in this. And we're full on this one now. Uh, let's just go ahead and get an attack line. Let's try to get some water on this. Being a little weird. Oh, where's the attack lines at? Can we get one back here? All discharged. There we go. A pump panel discharge to give them uh, 140. Good enough. There we go. We got some water. We may run out really fast, though. Windows knocked down a little bit here. Uh, we need writ too. Let's hit tab. Let's do that before Spur forgets. I was commit. Well, man, you guys are seeing everything today. Look at the chaos in the in the county. We got a building fire, trees down. Someone's having a heart attack in Little Miami. Man, it's just everything is falling apart. Um, let's see. What is the alarm? Let's go to a working alarm. That should be fine. And. Or we really like more of the issue is water related than anything right now. Uh, let's put down RIT too. Let's drop this guy. Actually, I wonder if we should be able to do it. Let's just hit end and see what it does. I'm not sure if it's going to let us do that with the line in our hand. Let's try it again. There we go. Yeah, it wouldn't let us do it with the line, but uh, now it will. All right, AI menu. Uh, firefighter rescue. We'll say engine one is doing that. Exit command, exit you, hit end again. And pick you up. There we go. All right. Hopefully our water is going to hold out on us. Do our mask. 
I don't think it is though, guys. I think we're gonna be in trouble. As far as water, the water situation. I don't know. The big tanker, like the the big tanker doesn't have a valve to open to send the water out, right? So it's almost like it's just flowing out gravity. It shows 250 going in the other tanker, but you know, I almost kind of wonder if we need to um, just have that go to the pond. That would probably be the best thing to do. No, actually, it's filling it up. Never mind. Okay, this one is filling up. It is filling up. Okay, so then with that said, we need to start sending water out. It's filling it up. It's just really super slow. Uh, let's do pump panel. What is our discharge, though? I don't know what discharge we were using for. I think it's going to be five, right? Uh, five, yeah. It's going to be five. Let's go back to the pump. All right, well, that's good. I'm glad it's filling it up. We're just only going to be able to send out like uh, uh, a max of 250, really. We'll do 225. We'll play it safe. We'll do 225. So that's going to fill up really slow, too. Our water look like on this guy. Three quarters. All right, so we could bring in... Uh, Let's see. Let's do... Uh, We've got water intake. We've got that coming in. Let's de decrease the uh, take fill. Let's do... Uh, we've got 130-ish going out, so we'll do... We'll do 170 in on this guy. That way, we're, we're always sending more water than what we're taking, right? Like, we've got more water going from the big tanker to the little tanker than we've got that water going to this and then we've got a little less going from this to there so good work out we'll see being slow i hardly like i said i hardly ever use tanker three that is one i just don't do a lot with i really just don't and it's so bad in here this is really going good uh, there's, uh, we gotta turn off gas. Really? I thought the gas blew up, to be honest. Like, what, <laughs> what was that all about? The propane tank just went up. Man, always something, right? Alright, let's drop this guy down right here. And let's go find the gas connection. It should be around back. Oh, come on. Where's the gas at? Where's the gas is at? I don't see the gas. Like, I don't see a gas connection, guys. It says turn the gas off, but I don't see a gas connection anywhere. What is all this? Is this new? I don't ever remember that being there. Yeah, we don't have a gas connection. What are they talking about? The gas blew up. Like, it totally blew up. So, you know what? Let's just keep going with it. We'll deal with that in a second. There we go. Get our mask going again. Get him put out. Let's get this guy. Guy there. Yeah, I don't know. That puzzles me. I don't see a gas connection unless I just completely missed it. Uh, the only gas I know about is the one that blew up. So technically gas should be like gone. It should be eliminated. It should be a problem anymore. That's a vent the room. Sweet. All right, we got that taken care of. Let's keep going this way. Hopefully there's no victims. And we know this room was clear when we first made entry. Well, we do have a victim. It's going to be our original firefighter. He went down. <coughs> because the room flashed. And when it flashed, man, that was it. Like, I was literally right there by the window. And, uh, and couldn't get out, right? Like that's happened. I the other one that flashed and killed me. Uh, I was in the process of going through the window, but like halfway in and out, right? And I still died. Like I died hanging out of the window. It was horrible. It's horrible, horrible situation. Okay, we're good with this. We got that one put out. So hopefully, oh, we do have a victim. I didn't see that dude, but he sure did. Uh, yeah, the oven got him. <laughs> the gas oven got him. No. Not good. All right, we'll bring him back. Keep going. There we go. I think this room is good to go. 
Uh, open this door up. Of course it's locked, right? It, it, of course. No surprise there. When you don't have a Halligan, you know it's going to be locked. Like, it's guaranteed to be locked. Alright, let's do this guy. Get our mask off. Let's go tools. Uh, forcible entry tool. Alright, let's see. We've got our Halligan. Let's get our mask back on. And uh, one thing real quick. I just wanted to thank you guys. Uh, you know, I'll be the first to tell you, uh, doing this YouTube channel hasn't always been easy. You know, uh, it's just, uh, you know, sometimes you go into things and you have certain expectations and things like that. And then when it doesn't meet them or doesn't exceed your expectations, you're always let down. Right. Uh, it's just the nature of things. And I am like, I am probably my own worst critic right like i just i'm highly critical of myself i always feel like i could do better i'm always looking at things that i could do better for the channel and stuff like that so it's really hard like not to uh not to kind of beat yourself up a little bit when things don't go your way or like you had uh expected them to and uh you know it never fails i i get on here and i look at the comments and i i read a comment like it says uh spur you know you're the reason why i play this game and i really love and enjoy your content and that is like that's the silver lining it, it really really is and i am forever grateful for that for you guys for the support uh, that you've given the channel and uh for you know encouraging me and uh enjoying and all that stuff like it really really truly does mean a lot and uh i do appreciate it and i don't you know i always say i don't feel like i tell you guys that enough so i did want to take a moment to uh to do that to let you know how much i do appreciate it all right now we got to get back to uh this oven softy spur is is done now <laughs> we gotta we gotta focus on uh the task at hand here all right let's see uh, we're going to lay this guy out by the RIT team. They can take care of him. If we can. There we go. And we need to figure out the gas. It says turn the gas off, but I did not see a gas connection anywhere. Where is this gas connection at? Uh, is it this right here? It's this little box right here. Man, it's Spur, seriously. It's that. The gas connection right there. Walked right by it. It's a little like to me that's like a phone connection, right? Like our gas like we have a gas meter going to our house and it's an actual like meter. You know, and then uh actually no, you just we don't need to mess with you. You stay right there. Don't go anywhere, right? Um and then we've got a big yellow valve like at the back of the house where the pipe goes into the house. Got it. So it's very obvious what it is. That like that honestly kind of looks like a phone hookup to me. Like a phone connection, like AT and T. Ah, uh, don't get me started on AT and T. We had AT and T internet forever. It was the worst internet I've ever had in all my years of having internets. Uh, it's the worst we ever had. Uh, they came to work on our internet one day at the house, and uh, they just ran a new line from the box on the street to our house, and just had it laying on top of the ground. Right? They said they'll come back later and bury it. Months and months and months and months went by. They still hadn't come back and bury it. We finally got fiber internet here at the house. One gig up, one gig down, which is absolutely amazing. It's the best internet I've ever had in all my years. Went from one extreme to the other. And so Spur finally got fed up with it and went to the phone box and disconnected it from his house. And then I just took it and wrapped it around their box on the street. <laughs> it is still out there. They, that's been like over a year ago. All right, guys, uh, the house fire is under control. We've got this guy here. Let, I guess we need to check on him, right? Like, uh, I really didn't want to mess with him, but you know what? We'll do it. We'll do all the things. We may as well. Uh, let's see, gear. We need the uh, medical bag. Okay. Yeah. We'll do that. I guess that means we need to call an ambulance, too, unless we can get this guy up and, like, okay. Uh, assess the patient. He is not assessing. Why is he not assessing? Sir, you okay? Hello? Um, yeah, he's not. We've got the medical bag. He should. He should totally assess. You know what? I, he's, I don't know what's going on with him. He's okay, though. He'll be all right. He's fine. 
All right, guys, that's going to do it for this one. Hope y'all enjoyed. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. I really do appreciate it. Love all of you, and uh, we'll catch you in Canton County next time. Peace.